Hello students, let's try to understand one problem student. Balance the following equation. They are saying by ion electron method student. By ion, it is going to be electron and here is method. Ion electron method student. So how can you balance dear student by ion electron method any of the equation? I am having that is the Cr207 2 minus. Okay. And it is being treated with the SO3 so it is giving CR3 plus plus it is giving SO4 2 minus this is what the compound um, now student you must be knowing how to calculate the oxidation number here is oxidation number is plus 6 here is oxidation number is you know SO2 is true, not SO3 it is SO3 means the problem here is the plus 4 is there I know if SO2 is there student so this is the plus 4 here is 4 to the 8 minus 2 that is going to be this is going to be plus 6 and what about this one plus 3 right student you see the plus 6 to plus 3 this is the reduction student and plus 4 to plus 6 increase in oxidation number that is going to oxidation right a student you can ask that is how the plus 6 there so 7 oxygen are there 7 to the 14 14 minus 2 that is 12 12 by 2 plus 6 so you must be knowing oxidation number otherwise you put me the message in comment box so I will share you the, uh, the rules for oxidation number um, now what we are doing is student in the step number 1 is splitting is to two half equation so CR207 this is going to be 2 minus it is converting into CR3 plus then next one is what is there student SO2 it is converting into SO4 2 minus right um, dear student you are in the step number 2 uh, what we are step number 1 and 2 we are balancing other than carbon and hydrogen so here chromium is 2 students so we are simply multiplying by 2 here sulfur is 1 1 everything is okay up is step number 3 balance what they are saying student balance what O by H2 O and H by what student H by H plus so let us try to balance so here we are having Cr207 2 minus so where you are going to Cr3 plus right 2 cr3 plus here oxygen are 7 so this side 7 h2o now this side hydrogen become 14 so it is the 14 h plus um, now the charge you see student 14 plus 2 minus here 6 plus so you need to add the 6 electron minus so that the charges both side will be equal we have to add the electron on that side where positive charge is more then you see the so 2 is there student and uh, here what are there that is the SO4 2 minus here oxygen is 4 student here 2 so I am adding that is 2 H2O um, now see the H plus where how many H plus are there 4 so I am adding 4 H plus to make it stable 4 H plus I am adding 2 electron here so what will happen 4 plus and 4 minus are equal see student um, now we need to equals the electron in both the equation how can you multiply by 1 and here is multiply by what is student multiply by 3 after that you need to write the answer student see CR207 going to be 2 minus okay plus 14 H plus plus 6 electron minus it is going to give student 2 CR3 plus plus 7 H2O divided by what 3 SO2 plus 6 H2O 3 SO4 2 minus plus 12 H plus plus 6 electron minus now students see what are the cancel out this is the left side and this is right side cancel out here 7 H 6 H2O and this side 7 H2O so after subtracting here will be that is 1 H2O will be left student. Here is 12 H plus and this side 14 H plus means subtracting it will give 2 H plus right arrow is here. 
what are the left other things there is nothing is common so you can rewrite the other things easily so here is cr2 o7 2 minus plus what is there 3 so2 plus 2 h plus this side you see is 2 cr3 plus plus 3 so4 3 so4 2 minus so this is all about the balance equation friends this is the now valence equation you can check out your answer here h2o you can write this side i know here h2o and <clears throat> you can check better you can check chromium oxygen sulfur hydrogen charge this side chromium oxygen sulfur hydrogen and charge how many chromium are there student two this side two oxygen how many are there student 7 3 to the 6 13 this side how many are there that is going to be 13 4 3 the 12 1 13 sulfur you check student sulfur is 3 this side sulfur is again going to be 3 hydrogen is how much student 2 this side 2 charges you see 2 minus 2 plus that is going to be 0 this side 2 3 the 6 3 2 the 6 that is 6 plus 6 minus 0 so student these are the everything are balanced so this equation is hence balanced this is going to be hence balanced student so this is all about the answer student thank you so much for watching okay